freezing. I just got here. Uh, I'm gonna do like light jumps. Just take it easy. I'm really sore from my last workout. And uh, just see what I can do. Get some max jumps and probably lift explosively. But it's freezing to see what I can do. Baby room for technique as well. I want to make a two-hand dribble dunk with the sweats on, feeling so low like this. I definitely feel really fatigued today. I don't know if I'm a little under the weather or getting under the weather, but I don't have that full aggression to go hard. It might be because it's cold, but I might cut it short soon. I really should stop. I got some good technique in. Got a little better. I think it helped that I was a little slow so I could take it slow. Focus on my technique instead of go too hard. Some decent jumps. I'll tell you more after, but last one. I jumped pretty well. Um, started off really slow, being cold and fatigued, but I got up a little bit. Um, not my highest, but I'm happy with today. It's kind of exactly what I wanted to do get some technique work where my slow approach jumps felt good. I felt more on point today. Uh, I focused on technique and taking it slow. So that's why my jumps look slow, but also because I'm really fatigued. I feel like I'm a little bit uh, overworked, but um, I felt like that during the middle, but now I feel better. So um, I'm gonna see how I feel in two days. I'm gonna do a little lifting now, explosively. And then uh, in two days, if I feel really fatigued, I'm gonna take it easy and just do recovery explosive stuff until I feel 100% because I don't wanna overtrain and I'm jumping good and my technique is good. So I think from now on, it's just, not from now on, but going forward, I'm gonna see how I feel. Um, take it easy, still focus on technique. Keep coming back to this rim so I could uh, focus on my technique more. It feels really good. And then uh, 
Dribble dunks felt really good, especially one hand, but my two hand was terrible. But um, it's not bad for being so fatigued because I feel really, really tired. It's really hard to go 100%. East Bay felt better, and I remember I realized I need to go a little bit more to the top of the key. So that felt good. I got a couple decent attempts, but still pretty bad. And all my motions are really slow on all my tricks. So um, footwork's feeling good, but my technique on dunks is really slow. That's just fatigue and my jumps feel slow. You can probably tell I'm not running full speed or anything like that, but it feels good to focus on technique. Uh, I feel like if I have another healthy day here, I can really kill it. And then once my technique is on point here a lot, I'm gonna start moving up to other rims because I was doing good on higher rims, but like always off and on. So I really wanna get my technique down pat, keep lifting. I just got back into lifting, so that probably fatigues me because I lifted the day after that big session. So probably almost close to overwork. So now, I've said this a million times, but Take it easy, recover, and have another dunk session. Let's go. Reason. So on days like this, I like to do light dunks, a little less dunks and a little more workout, but I kind of got carried away with the dunks because it was fun. But uh, I like to do the explosive lifts, a little bit of weight, but just do everything explosive. Focus on going, what's up, bro? What's up, hey. baby? <laughs> we out here. <laughs> so yeah, that's pretty much it. Just work, focus on the transition from the downward to up phase and there's Skylar. There he is pulling up, saucy. Some wick wicked shots. Uh huh. And some saucy dunks. <laughs> I gotta go. And some saucy dunks. Saucy dunks. Saucy, saucy, saucy dunks.